All right, welcome to MA Tips. We're going to talk about a topic we've actually touched on before, but it has been improved in the last few versions. And if you have been trying to make your phasers symmetrical, this is the trick that you need to add to your tool belt. First, we're going to start by grabbing fixtures one through eight. I have highlight on so that my fixtures turn on for me automatically. And let's create two points. So I'm gonna make two absolute points downstage, and we're gonna turn this into a circle. So I'll select all the points with this tool, grab the move handles tool and pull out from either point because I have them both selected. They both move together, that's perfect. Okay, so now we have this circle going, but we want it to be symmetrical. This is when I'm gonna hop down here into my MA tricks window and I'm going to set my phase to go from 0 to 360. Notice I can just click in the phase 2 as soon as I set it. It assumes my from is going to be from 0. Nice little trick to save time there. Uh, the next thing I want to do is set my wings to 2. Another trick in this window is to just pull and slide with your finger or with your mouse. These act as sliders. Another fun thing to do. All right, so we're going to come down here to transform. Transform currently has new op two options. You have none and mirror. When I set it to mirror, what it's gonna do is take half of the selection and invert their pan so that it's moving in the opposite direction. And now I have very easily created a symmetrical phaser. However, what happens if I have an odd number of fixtures? Let's take a look at that. So I'm gonna store this here. All righty. We'll call this my circle. All right, all right, let's clear out of the programmer and let's create another phaser together. So I'm gonna take my gridded spots group. Uh, if I take a look at this group here, pull up my selection grid, I can see I have my spots laid out so there's an odd number. There's gonna be a middle fixture. We just wanna see what the mirror tool is gonna do with that middle fixture. All right, let's hop back into the phaser editor and we're gonna make a little square effect this time. So let's draw four points. One, two, three, four, eh, something like that. All right, same idea in the matrix window. I'm gonna set my phase two to be 360 and I'm gonna set my wings to two. All right, so once that is done, I'm gonna go over here to transform and set it to mirror and see what it's done. It's actually taken this middle fixture here and it's a different color, letting you know that it is the center fixture in our selection. And you notice its pan went away entirely. It's actually just doing the tilt portion of the phaser. You can also see that in the phaser editor, how it's getting from point A to point B. All right, and that is mirror. You can start adding that into your symmetrical phasers.